Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. We bet you've been amazed by those seemingly impossible but real magic tricks of magicians. Disappearing Statue of Liberty? Or man levitating in the sky? How do they even do it? Sometimes, the explanation of the most dazzling and mysterious magic trick is right there on the surface. In today's episode, we're going to show you the top 10 greatest magic tricks revealed. Number 10. Walking on Water have you ever tried walking on water? Well, we know we can't. Dynamo, the most incredible street magician, was seen walking on the water of the Thames River in his television show Dynamo, Magician Impossible. But how do magicians do it? Well, the answer to this trick lies in the use of plexiglass. Plexiglass is a particular type of glass whose density is almost like water and when it's submerged in the water is practically hard to find. Plexiglasses are clearly supported by plexi tubes, which are circular tubes made from plexiglass, and many magicians have tried the same variant in swimming pools or water lakes. The trick is usually performed in muddy or unclear rivers or man-made water like swimming pools. The main trick lies in making a glass or transparent plastic platform essentially invisible to the audience. Now you can walk on water without any superpowers. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it. It really works. Number 9. Dove Illusion You've probably seen magicians taking some bird out of the fire when initially there was no sign of its existence bird from fire? How? Darcy Oak, the contestant magician in Britain's Got Talent, showed the magic in which he got pigeons from burning feathers. That's insane, but there's a hidden secret behind it. The feathers that Darcy Oak showed us before lighting it up are actually a particular type of paper known as flash paper. Flash paper is very commonly used by magicians in their magic tricks to create quick, large flashes of fire that hide the fleeting moments that make the illusion for the audience. And so did Darcy Oak use the flash paper. Using the chance of a quick flash of fire, Darcy Oak quickly got the pigeons from his left hand secret sleeve pocket. So there was no magic, just the quick momentum of time. And we think you just missed that, isn't it? Number 8. Deck Levitation Well, this trick has always tricked people and just left them in surprise. The magician in this trick tells of choosing any card at random from the deck. Once selected, the magician places it back into the deck. Now, how is he going to tell which card you chose? He places the deck of cards in a glass and makes some magical gestures, and the card gets popped out. Yeah, there's some trick here as well. The card chosen at random is placed back into the deck where the magician wanted it to be. He puts the remaining cards back over the deck, which is supported by a particular card at the end. The special card is supported by a counterweight that moves a small pad upwards when the card is turned upside down. And this pad has a small dot of wax that sticks to the card and moves the card upwards, making it pop out of the deck. There you have it, the card you chose. Number 7. Girl Levitating in Air Can you levitate in the air? I mean, without any support or cables? Well, you must have seen in magic shows a beautiful girl floating in the air on a wood plank. And to prove that it's real, a ring is passed around her to ensure the audience that the plank is not supported by strings or rods. If you think that the girl or magician has some superpowers, then you're wrong, as there is a unique trick used here. The secret is in the plank of the wood that is supported by a solid hydraulic piston mechanism to hold the plank up in the air. This mechanism is hidden when the magician steps on the platform and takes his position. To control the motion of the plank, there's a button under the foot of the magician. Yeah, we know what you might be thinking. How is the ring then moved around her? The secret to that lies in the S-shaped design of the support rod. It can quickly move the ring to the end and repeat back the movement to get the exit. Pretty intelligent move. Number 6. Disappearing Statue of Liberty Yes, you heard that right. The Statue of Liberty was once disappeared in front of the whole audience. This happened back in the year 1983. 
David Copperfield made the Statue of Liberty disappear completely. But there is a trick in it as well. The trick can be explained very simply. The statue was draped with a massive piece of fabric or covered by a big screen put in front of the audience. The entire illumination of the monument was turned off except for the spotlights. This simple preparation created the illusion of hollow space and the set of lights blinded the audience. Also, there comes another major trick. Once the monument was hidden, the whole platform with the stage and audience was moved to another side. This whole thing was planned in such a way that no one felt any changes. After the monument was unveiled, people were not able to see it because there was no statue in front of them. It was hidden on another side. Its view was blocked by the pillars made on the stage. Quite clever. Number 5. Water into ice in seconds It's impossible to turn water into ice in a second, even with a deep freezer. But in this magic trick, the magician pours water into a cup and instantly turns it into a piece of ice. Well, the cup already contained a piece of ice in it and a sponge of the same color as the cup at the bottom. The water is absorbed by the sponge and what is left when turning the cup upside down is the ice. Simple. Number 4. Twisting an iPhone Can you twist your iPhone from its center? Obviously not, and why would you? It's an iPhone. Dynamo has done it in front of people on the streets. He took an iPhone and magically twisted it from its center to half screen and half back position. How did he do it? Well, to perform this trick, Dynamo took an exact half back cover of the iPhone and placed it carefully, holding it over the screen. Now showing the audience the back of the iPhone first, he covered the iPhone with both of his hands and instead of twisting it, he just rotated the iPhone entirely to the screen side with the half back cover placed over it. If you observe deeply, you can see him rotating the phone as a whole. Number 3. The Lemon Trick Do you remember Jamie Raven, the magician famous in Britain's Got Talent? Yeah, let's talk about that famous lemon trick. Jamie got a signed note by Alicia out from the lemon that was kept intact in front of her since the start of the magic. How? Let's see. While Jamie Raven was folding the note, he had a palmed piece of paper in his hands that he instantly switched to and showed to the people. Now with the signed note still in his hand, he takes the bag from Alicia and drops the note into the bag very quickly. He reaches into the bag, stuffs the lemon with the note, and takes it out. He only shows one side of the lemon to the audience and cuts it very much differently. Now when Alicia took the note out of the lemon, he very quickly closes it and puts it away. But if you have looked closely, you could see a hole in the lemon at the bottom which was very clearly visible. And it was this hole through which he stuffed the note inside the lemon and the magic was created. And now let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by a subscriber. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Number 2. The Subscriber's Pick our subscriber picture today shows us the most famous trick of magicians, sawing someone in half. A woman is placed inside a box with only her legs and head popping out of either end. A chainsaw cuts through the box, cutting the woman in half, with her legs and head still moving. Ever wondered how they do it? It's all about the correct stage setup and a tall volunteer. The magician is not alone in this trick, but supported by one of his assistants for the later part of the body. The actual positioning is done in such a way that together they seem to be just a single person. Let's break it down. All the secret lies in the table beneath and the slight gap between the tables that can easily pass a saw blade from that. The body of the magician is bent into the table while the assistant's upper body is hidden in the table below. Number 1. Water Torture Escape the greatest and most sensational of all of Houdini's escapes was, without a doubt, his Chinese water torture cell. In this trick, Houdini had to escape an extraordinary contraption resembling a fish tank. The tank was filled with water while Houdini was placed head down in full view of the audience. You know what the secret is here. The assistants had locked Houdini upside down with genuine locks, but they'd removed the pins out of the hinges that held the locks. And this made it easier for the magician to escape. Also, the handcuffs were specially designed to get open with just a little force. 
And these all mechanisms finally led Houdini to escape from the water tank. And that concludes our list of the 10 greatest magic tricks revealed. Which one surprised you? Comment down below to let us know. Before you go, don't forget to like and subscribe and click the bell icon to stay up to date with our latest videos. We'll see you next time.